The amazing capabilities of James Webb have been demonstrated by a close-up look at the center of one of the galaxies in Stefan's Quintet. Webb was able to show us gas around a supermassive black hole like never before. One of the five galaxies in Stefan's Quintet, NGC 7319, had a supermassive black hole that JWST was able to characterize the atmosphere around. This was one of the telescope's initial scientific objectives. It allowed scientists to see the gas in the active galaxy core at hitherto undetected wavelengths. It was able to observe atomic hydrogen and hydrogen molecules, which are created when two atomic atoms link together. Using its near-infrared instrument, iron ions were also seen. This is a great marker for the location of the heated gas surrounding the supermassive black hole. Black holes don't produce light, but when they devour, like this one, they make a mess. The substance they are munching on becomes extremely heated due to the tremendous gravitational pull. The supermassive black hole at the heart of NGC 7319 is six times as big as Sagittarius A star, which is located in the Milky Way's galactic core, or 24 million times more massive than our Sun. But unlike Sagittarius A star, this supermassive black hole emits radiation at a phenomenal rate, comparable to the brightness of 40 billion suns all at once. JWST was able to examine more than just iron and hydrogen. The telescope saw an outflow of hot gas that contained hot ionized gases including iron, argon, neon, sulfur, and oxygen in its mid-infrared studies. Additionally, the surroundings of the black hole are rich in hydrogen and silicate dust, which are much smaller than sand grains. JWST also recorded the gas's motion and velocity. The wavelength of electromagnetic radiation of things that generate light changes as they travel closer or farther away from you, similar to how the ambulance's siren becomes louder as it gets closer to you. However, the telescope could thus determine the direction and speed of the gas's motion. We can comprehend supermassive black holes everywhere in the universe by studying them in surrounding galaxies. The Stefan's Quintet consists of four galaxies that are tightly clustered together and one that only optically seems to be nearby. The group's distance from Earth is 290 million light years. The 150 million pixel image of the group taken by JWST was put together from around a thousand individual image files. The luminous core of NGC 7320, the nearest object in the group, as well as individual stars, were seen through the telescope. Let us know in the comments what you think. Don't forget to like, subscribe, check out our previous videos, and visit our website if you love reading at www.nasaspacenews.com Thanks for watching.